The artist is at work already out there and there. What can I do with this mountain of bread? Will it be the sliced bread? Or will it be the roti? Roti naan? <laughs> the child will have a mountain of bread. And there are those who will follow him. Knowing that he is the child, but they follow him for his bread. A mountain of bread symbolizes wealth, doesn't it? So he's going to accumulate such an enormous amount, amount of wealth. The large numbers of people are going to follow him just for his wealth. And in the process of following him for his wealth, they worship him instead of Allah. And they go into the hellfire. I wonder how is he going to accumulate all that wealth? Hmm? The Prophet said, Sallallahu Ta'ala Alaihi Wasallam, that the age of Dajjal would be the age of Kathra to Riba. Meaning that in the age of Dajjal there will be the prevalence of riba. What is riba? And how does riba deliver bread? Huh? Rotinan. How? <laughs> I'll tell you how. One form of riba is borrowing and lending money on interest. And then the Jal has another means, also riba, through which to get more bread. What he does is that he replaces real money, dinar and dirham. Here we are, dinar and dirham, which is in the Quran, which is in the Sunnah, which is money which has its value inside the money. He takes that out of the market. He uses the International Monetary Fund to make it haram, to use gold as money. And after the Dajjal took the dinar and dirham out of the market, he then replaced it with bogus and fraudulent and utterly haram 
paper currencies. Those who follow the Dajjal, all that they have to do is to get a printing press and get paper and get ink and they can print as much money as they want and they can use that money to buy anything in the world they want to buy free of charge if there's anyone who wants to challenge me on that statement I'll be delighted to take the challenge because I've studied my subject I know what I'm talking about it's free you just have to print the paper so that's a lot of bread, eh? And they're printing the paper like mad now. The banks are in problems, so they give this bank seven billion. And they give that bank ten billion. <laughs> the Dajjal has given us a monetary system <laughs> which is unjust and is ripping us off. And so his mountain of bread is constantly increasing. Who is to be blamed for this? Answer, the one-eyed people who have eyes and yet cannot see. Amongst them, who have the greatest blame of all? Answer, the scholars of Islam. The scholars of Islam have failed miserably, colossally. And that is why we are in the mess in which we are now. And because I speak these words, there are so many masajid, they don't want Imran Hussein. In 1897, European...